Hi, Chicky. And our guest, traveling comedian Matt Holt. Hi, Matt. Hello. In the interview you, loft? Yeah. No, no. I feel no the loft. There's no, no loft. loft. He's, he's, he's sitting right here in a chair with us. <laughs> same level. Stop it. We're going to... Can we... Can I talk to you? Now? Oh, sure. Maybe make yeah. lunch plans or something. Yeah. Yeah. Why no. are you holding no. the crowbar? No. <laughs> hey, where are you going with that crowbar? <laughs> uh, let's go back to Christy in the news desk, and uh, we'll uh, let Matt uh, chime in if he'd like. Okay, Matt? Sure. Oh, uh, wow. This is, this is different. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. You go right ahead. Hold on. Say what's ever on your mind, Matt. <laughs> hey, this is working, too. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Everything's working, baby. Well. We had a frog earlier. Now we have a snake. TSA officials at Newark Airport report a passenger forgot their snake at a security checkpoint Monday. Let's see. Phone. Wall. <laughs> Wallet, keys. Where's my, Where's my snake? 15 inch long snake was discovered by a young girl who alerted a TSA officer. A gray checkpoint bin was placed over the snake and the security lane was temporarily closed while Port Authority police took the reptile away. New Jersey Federal Security Director Tom Carter said that the owner of the snake should not call them or expect to be reunited. Ooh. Now, Matt, They've I already whipped it into the woods. <laughs> yeah. Yes. <laughs> Matt, I don't know if you know this, but Josh Arnold. Former snake owner. Yeah, really? I didn't yeah. know you had a ponytail. <laughs> I, I did not. I did, yeah, that's one of the uh, snake yeah. owner yeah. stereotypes. That's I did true. not have. But wow. I did. What, I what kind of snake did you a have? A ball python. All right, I don't use. Could use green would work. I don't know my snakes. A ball but, python. Yeah, because they tend to ball up. How, yeah. how big was it? What did it weigh? Well, I got it as a baby. Did you wrap it around your wrist and wear yes. it around? Like well, I didn't know. <laughs> it was always. I never took it out of the house. It was always in well apartment. So uh -huh. it would go like this. You would uh, go home after a hard day at work. Yeah. Get your snake out of the tank. Just lay with it on the couch. Go sit on the couch and watch TV. <laughs> My brother drunkenly laid with it on the couch, and we lost it for a week. Oh. Really? Yeah. Wow. Joey Wednesday? No, oh, Johnny. Oh. I would never sleep. Yeah, we didn't care. Well, they're we weren't, a little, they're not we weren't afraid of you. it. Oh. At that point, it was probably two feet long. Yeah. Oh. And they're only about that big in diameter. Which but, is, and if you have a snake in your house, there's no worry about a girl being afraid because she's not coming over. That's so. true. You didn't have mice. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, exactly. But we had there were girls over there. We just didn't mention the snake. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Okay. Would you do that? Let somebody come over and tell them uh, there might be a snake crawling around the place. What, what is that? It's not a snake. I can tell you that. <laughs> uh, it's a penis. Oh. Um, well, 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 well. How long did you have the... I'm fascinated by A couple of years. And, and then uh, I full, moved and my brother grown? John really liked the snake. And so he kept it, but then his uh, girlfriend moved in, and the snake a sensible individual. died like two or three Ooh. days later. The, sna oh. the snake she hated with a passion. On her watch. She killed it. I think she killed it. How do you kill it? And now snake? when I bring it up to her, they're now married. And I say, remember that snake you killed? And she just kind of laughs. Ooh. Ooh. Oh. Has never said I didn't kill it. How would you kill a snake? I don't know. I don't know. Choke it? Isn't it like something like put a marshmallow in the, in the tank and they eat it and it swells up and suffocates them or something? All those little silica gel yeah, packets. Yeah, it's Mentos. Really? It dries out, dries out your you snake. No, I don't know. I just oh, made it up right that's here. That's yeah. interesting. I'm, I'm sure someone like will email. Work. That sound like that would work. Though, yeah, we may have sewn up a little mouse uh, suit with arsenic or something. <laughs> oh jeez! I don't know. Oh, you see her at the, the sewing machine humming a little song. Yeah, yeah this will do it. Mm -hmm. What was your snake's name? Mode. It's got to be a good mouse. Sigourney Weaver. Snake. Yeah. Sigourney Weaver. Yeah, yeah. That was really, the name of my snake. That's yeah. a ma that's a wordy mouth. Wordy mouth. That's a wordy name for a snake. Yeah, yeah. Did he come when you called him? Uh, we don't or know if she? it was, we never found out if it was, it, it hadn't been sexed. Apparently uh, it's very difficult to sex a well, snake. Well, <laughs> for you, baby. You have the right music and the it's right liquor. It's a crazy, it's a crazy ordeal. Music's Avalon.